Hey everybody, welcome back to another Clash Royale video. Today I'm in a whole different other setting. You know, I'm not in my original Bettyverse. And I know you guys might be confused on why I got a Hitler haircut. And why I just got a new haircut and why I got all the red hair absolutely nerfed bitty witty gang i guess you guys wasn't expecting in this new update of the channel for the red hair to get absolutely patched up but yes in this new update bitty witty gang your boy got a new haircut you know i got a mommy's cut you know your boy looks nice bitty witty gang let me just defend this thug real quick your boy looks nice, you know. I'm tired of people saying like, Uh, Mr. K, let me like dick in the butt since you had red hair. I think I look personally nice. But today ain't really about my red hair. Today I want to morally talk about... I don't know why it's saying my internet is bad, but today I just morally want to talk about going back to school and how it will affect my channel and my mental health. Yes, school is literally right around the corner and I've been online schooled for about eight years. If it's not hard to tell, but would again, your boy... That's how I found out about, not how I found out about YouTube, but that's how I got into YouTube is because your boy was at home 24-7, had no friends, had nothing to do. So your boy became an expert at making YouTube videos. And yeah, just going back to school, a lot of people has been saying it's going to change me and it's going to change my pussy fart attitude and I'm going to start acting Hollywood and I'm not going to be making the same jokes on the channel. I want you guys to know I'm not going to let any bullies bully me into me acting a different way bitty would again just because i act all pushy fartish on my videos doesn't mean i'm gonna stop acting pussy fartish in my videos just because what i'm gonna get bullied at school for my videos you think i care pussy fart what are you doing with your life probably getting money and probably getting girls Everything I'm not doing, but we don't talk about it. What are you doing in your life right now that's going to help you beneficially in the future, Bitty Woody Gang? That's what that's my argument against all these like weirdos that just keep, I don't know, keep on like, always have something to complain about, Bitty Woody Gang. Everything you're going to do in life, I want you pussy farts to know. Like, these people at school is not your real friends. I will say this before I go back. Anybody at my school watching this, I'm coming for you. I'm going to come all over for I hate when people do minors. I'm just gonna spark you this. But yeah, but again, I, I don't, I don't see anything necessarily wrong with me going back to school. Yes, it will be a change. Okay, so I didn't know Sparky react. I didn't know the Zap reactivates Sparky's time limit. See, now you learn something new every single day, but he would again, even if it's by bot. But anyway, your boy had to get a mommy's cut. You know, I feel like life. Life is funny, Bitty Witty Gang. God's gonna throw a whole bunch of, like, challenges your way, but it's just really up to you if, like, you could take on the challenges. Me going back to school, because I've been lonely. This ain't really what I like to talk about on the channel. It's not really, like, a very happy topic to talk about, but I've been lonely for most of my life. So going back, getting uh placed around a lot of kids my age, it's gonna be, like, a very new step. It's going to be a new di direction into my life, Bitty Witty Gang, because, you know, your boy don't really have friends. Not that I don't really even want any. Like, I just don't like people anymore. A lot of people just turn out to be fake, and a lot of people's a waste of your time. I don't know why you pussy fart semens are wasting half of your time talking to half of these puss farts at school, but I just know what I'm signing myself up for. I just need to, like, I feel like I'm a robot right now. You know, I have very strict parents, so Biddy Woody Game, my parents kept me inside the house as long as they could. I'm still in, I'm inside the house as we currently speak, but, um... I have very strict parents, so I wasn't normally the go-out-and-party type, like the I-like-dick-in-my-butt type. Your boy's been very secluded. Oh, I'm sad. I'm sad, Betty Woody Gang. Freaking sad. Freaking sad. I'm sorry. But your boy's never been the partying type. So this is the first time in my life where I'm just going to get surrounded by a whole bunch of people. Yes, it's going to be very overwhelming, but I think God doesn't throw challenges his strongest soldiers can't handle. And great, he definitely's throwing a challenge I can't handle because my tower is gone! Anyway, Biddy Woody Gang, I just wanted to come tell you guys because a lot of people think me going back to public school, I'm barely going to be able to upload for you guys. Don't worry. Never in my life. Have I made YouTube a last priority? I don't care if there's a missing arm off my body. Your boy's still going to be uploading daily, Bitty Woody Gang. So, yes, nothing changes on the channel. If anything, I'll be working even harder on the channel. Yes, I don't know why I haven't just gave up yet. What an absolute hell of a match! Dude, I can't win. This is physically impossible.
Hey. That was physically impossible to win, but he would again. I don't know how I held up as long as I did, but your boy lost. Anyway, I just wanted to come talk to you guys about me going back to school. Nothing's going to change on the channel. If anything, your boy's going to learn a lot more life experiences. So I'll have a lot more stories to tell you guys as I play this pussy fart game over here. And yeah, this ain't my original setup. I'm just in my uncle's shack right now. Your boy just got done getting the 2.6 elixir cut. Your boy looks kind of good right now. And plus, just comment your guys' thoughts on my new haircut. Do I got better hair than the red pussy fart? I like gay. Like, Because I, I did look a little bit gay. I don't like dick in my butt, just to clarify. So thank you guys for watching Biddy Woody Gang. Your boy's going back to school. I would get to be surrounded by a lot of people. Hopefully they don't push me in a locker. Hopefully they don't find my YouTube channel. You know what? If they find my YouTube channel and they start claim clowning me for it, Biddy Woody Gang, I'm just going to tell them, do something in your life, buddy. Do something in your life that makes you happy. So yeah, Biddy Woody Gang, jokes on them. I'm going to win. Regardless, I've won in life. So yeah, Biddy Woody Gang, not everything has to be a negative. Turn everything into a positive, Biddy Woody Gang, and stop caring about your problems, because that only creates more problems. So yeah, Biddy Woody Gang, thank you guys for watching. You learn something new every day. And yeah, I just want to let you guys know this channel is going to become a lot more wholesome, because I, I'm kind of just going to drop the act and start acting like my pussy fart self. Because I feel like a lot of you guys like me. So, anyway, without further ado, Biddy Woody Gang, your boy's going back to public school. Absolutely going to get bullied. Going to get a broomstick shoved up my booty lips. First day. So, if I come back and I look a little bit different, I look a little bit cloned, don't worry. It's just I got a couple dicks in my butt from school. Use cold Mr. Caleb in the item shop. A lot of you guys ain't even using cold Mr. Caleb. Let me just use it real quick. Code Mr. Caleb, a lot of you guys need to use this code. I don't know why you guys ain't using it. Let me fix that real quick. It's a little typo. I'm sorry. I can't really type with one hand. It won't let me fix the... Mm, my God, the stupid game. Mr. Caleb. All right, yep. Use Mr. Caleb code in the Clash Royale item shop. Let me do something they can't copy. When they see you down, they think you pussy, so just stay cocky. Yeah, I know that they gon' talk, but we stay ready like the game lobby. Bro, walk in with that stick, you want that nice, we could just play hockey. Love that, but in that bitch, realized I hate college. Guess that's where it all starts.